Hello, this is Dr. Gay from First Sick MRI. And this is a 45-year-old female with shoulder pain. She had had an injury many months ago, and the pain has not subsided. She has uh, an anchor here. Her biceps tendon has been reattached, her biceps tenodesis. Biceps tendon looked good below that. You might notice also this little anchor here. She had a labral repair that was successful. A little anchor here in the glenoid, some tendinosis of the rotator cuff, but the main finding was up here, the distal clavicle had intense marrow edema, the acromion looked pretty good, also there was some periostitis around this, so if we put up another view here, we can see the really intense marrow edema within the distal clavicle, the associated periostitis, and uh, there's been no recent trauma, so this looks like a case of osteolysis, they call it AC osteolysis, where you get chronic repetitive motion at the AC joint, in this case, they had had an old injury, so maybe they had an old fracture of the clavicle, and things are loose now there, and there's an altered mechanics, and now having a chronic repetitive motion and this uh, reactive marrow edema. But again, we call this AC osteolysis. osteolysis. We see this with weightlifters a lot, where they weightlift and they cause abnormal shear forces um, on the AC joint, you know, chronically when they're working out. Um, but this is a case that, again, may be related to an old injury with altered mechanics there but a case of AC osteolysis, probably the cause of their pain, and thank you very much.